<laughs> you got here faster than I thought you would, Yagami-san. Well, how'd it go? Find anything between Kajihira and Kazumi? <laughs> Just a couple of rumors, really. Then what's with that grin? Fine. You got me. You know that meeting they had? Turns out, it was about the ADDC. What? For years now, the Kajihira group has been secretly planning an absolutely massive redevelopment project. And where were they planning it? This plot of land, right here. That's the ADDC. Yep, the area around it too. To be precise, Kajihira wanted all the land belonging to the Medical Institute. Which, as you know, is managed by none other than the Ministry of Health. That explains why Kajihira needed to talk to Minister Kazumi. If they want to go forward with the redevelopment, they'll have to shut the Institute down, including the ADDC. But is getting just one bigwig on board with the project enough? It is in this case. Apparently, Kazumi was already planning to shut the center down. Huh? See, the Institute was created with the goal of addressing Japan's aging population problem. Too many seniors, not enough babies, all that. But for the past 10 years, the money's been going into a black hole. People even call it a tax scam. I mean, they're not wrong. Management's just a bunch of crusty government types. I see. So if the Minister of Health says the time's up... Bye-bye, ADDC. Hello, giant plot of land. Wouldn't that reflect poorly on Kazumi, though? Maybe. But I doubt he'd mind so long as he got a nice kickback from it. And that's exactly what Kajihira put on the table. I'm sure it was enough to cover the damage. A big old bribe, basically. On top of that, Kajihira bought up all the land around the center years back to avoid rising prices. <laughs> They're not even trying to hide it. Yep, but as luck would have it, it just wasn't meant to be. One day, Kajihira's redevelopment project suddenly got flushed down the drain. Something happened preventing the ADDC from closing. And it's all thanks to this guy. Kido and his 89 research. Yeah, you don't just shut down a dementia drug that could change the world. So Kazumi started singing 89's praises to anyone who'd listen. And you know how it ends. The ADDC stayed in business, the money kept flowing, the research kept going. Kazumi brushed the whole deal under the rug. And pulled it right out from under Kajihira. Yep. Guy must have lost billions in the process. I wonder what that feels like. I guess he's not too happy with this 89 business. Right. How'd you get all this anyway? I literally asked you today. <laughs> you want to look behind the curtain, huh? What? It's not that impressive. It was all published online last year. It was a pretty gripping article, but they couldn't substantiate their claims. Everyone wrote it off as tabloid nonsense. I think they might have been right. W why? The piece is by Kohatori. And he's an asshole. W you know him? Yeah, we go back. And apparently, he stormed Genda's office today looking for an interview. Huh? Doesn't that mean you can ask him yourself? You better get a move on. Uh, I guess I'll have to. Bring it on. 
Really, guys? いらっしゃいませ。Stuff. ありがとうございました。Oh, hey, Yagami-san. Satori still here? No, he actually left a while ago. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you really did scare him off then, huh? More like he couldn't handle Saori-san staring into his soul. <laughs> Who can? By the way, um... Hmm? Mafuyu. I came to offer condolences for Shintani Sensei. That's not the only reason. Tell Yagami san straight. Right. Something you needed to say? Yes. Well, Izumira wants to take you in, Yagami kun. For Shintani Sensei's murder. Does he? A detective by the name of Kuroiwa said I was a material witness, too. What is going on, Yagami kun? <sighs> hey, I could ask you the same thing. Just to be sure, you didn't do it, did you? Me? Kill Shintani? Yes. Of course I didn't. How could you even ask? I'm a prosecutor, remember? Doubting people is my job. So why does Izumita suspect me? Does he even have anything to go on? I I'm not sure. They're leaving me out of the loop on purpose, I think. But even Morita-san suspects you. They really don't like me, huh? I don't think they can charge you with a murder on the grounds of not liking you, Yakumi-kun. Well, either way, I'm glad you didn't kill anyone. But if anything comes up, feel free to get in touch. If it's within my power, I'll do what I can to help. Thanks, Mafuyu. See you later. Say goodbye to Genda Sensei for me. Did Sugiura-san end up finding anything? What's the latest? He did. Apparently Kajihiro was trying to get Kazumi to close down the ADDC. Wait... What? He wanted to use the center's land for his redevelopment project. But then the AD9 research came out and threw a wrench into things. Kajihiro lost a lot of money. Wait a second. That means he's connected directly to the ADDC. According to Hattori's article, at least. Hattori-san wrote about it? That's why I stopped by. I wanted to ask him about it in person. So, he hangs around when you don't want him, and then when you need him, he's nowhere in sight. <sighs> that guy's the worst, seriously. Hello? 
Nagami-san, it's Sugiura. Uh, did a woman just leave that office you hang around in? Hmm? Oh, you must mean Mafuyu. Oh, I didn't know her name. She's pretty, though. Wait, does that mean you've been following me? I'll tell you later. I'd worry more about all the Yakuza tailing Mafuyu-san. Huh? Yeah, it's like four Yakuza. Maybe more. What should I do? We should do something, right? I'll be right there. Where are you? Head straight to Theater Square once you're down. And be quick about it, yeah? I can't take them all by myself, Yagami-san. You coming, Yagami-san? Where are you? I just left Ganda's office. How's my for you? Fine for now. But maybe not much longer. Those Yakuza are getting closer by the minute. You've gotta hurry, Yagami-san. She's just about to cross Theater Square. Are you there, Yagami-san? Mafuyu just went left on Theater Avenue. Got it, thanks. She's got even more Yakuza on her tail now. It's way more than four by my count. Are they on her about some Yakuza-related case? What family are they from? I haven't figured that out. Better just to get over to her quick. Yo, roads closed, pal. You're Yagami, yeah? I don't have time for this. Afraid that's not your call. We've got an appointment with the lady prosecutor, you see. What? You heard me, asshole. Now step the fuck back, or else! Damn it! Who are you? And why are you following Mafuyu? <laughs> Don't think we're giving up that easy. Yo, need a hand talk? Kaito-san. I'm kinda bummed you started the party without me, man. I'm raring to go. What the hell? Not a second too late. Mind taking care of these guys? I gotta get after Mafuyu. Mafuyu, Chon? She's not in trouble, is she? Handle it, please. See ya. I get it. You guys are tailing Mafia, you chug. I can't exactly let that kind of shit slide, assholes. Ugh! Son of a bitch! Can you hear me, Yagami-san? Are you still coming? I'm coming. How's my for you? Safe. Over on Nakamichi Street now. Her and, uh, four more Yakuza. I don't know if I can take them on my own. Got it. What? I'm turning onto Nakamichi Street now. Hurry, okay? Watch your back, Yakuza-san. Looks like the Yakuza are onto you. Huh? All four of them are heading your way. Got it. Keep an eye on Mafuyu for me.
here because a friend tipped me off. Kaito's on help too. Don't forget to thank him later. I don't understand though. Why would the Yakuza come after me? Sorry, give me a second. Are you okay, Yagami-san? How's your friend? She's okay, thanks to you, Sugira. Oh, glad to hear it. By the way, I'm tailing that van that tried to nab her. Great. We'll need to figure out where it was going. Right. Hello, Izumeda-san? This is Fuji. Oh yeah, Yagami-san. Those Yakuza? Or Kyore. I recognized a few of them from KJR. Why would the Kyore go after Mafuyu? Uh, we might be better off asking them that in person. Think you can head over now? No. I need to make sure Mafuyu gets home safe first. I'll call you later. I I'll be fine. Don't worry. Izumida-san says he'll send some officers over for me. The Kyore clan is a Kansai-based group, yes? They're the ones who were harassing me? Looks like it. As for why... I think it was probably to get to me. Huh? I got kind of... involved with the Kyore clan. That's gotta have something to do with this. What are you doing messing with Yakuza? What is it? I saw them hit you earlier. Are you hurt? Uh, no. I'm gonna make sure this never happens again. Hmm? I'll sort this out with those Kyore guys. You can't! That's not safe! Don't worry about me, okay? I'll stay far away from Kamurocho for a while. In fact, maybe you should come with me, Yagami-kun. Lay low for a while. Your carriage awaits. You gonna be okay? I'm sorry, but I can't leave now. Not yet. Why, though? It looks like the killer we're after now somehow connected to the murder three years ago. That would mean... the Shinpei Okubo case? Yeah. Right before Shintani was killed, he tried to contact a researcher named Shono at the ADDC. The same Shono who testified against Okubo in the trial. That's all you have? <laughs> I'm still trying to piece everything together. But I have to keep going until this puzzle is solved. You know, it's been three years since I've seen you this worked up. Hmm? It's kind of refreshing, actually. Huh? <laughs> you just look so... alive. <laughs> Maybe I am. See you later. Hello? Hey, it's Yagami. I'm free now. Where are you?
Turns out the van never even left Camarocho. They all got out at some sketchy cabaret. A place called Honmaruen on Park Boulevard. Honmaruen. Gaito-san's heading over too. Gotcha. I'll be there ASAP. <laughs> 